as well, doesn't it? Yeah. So I admire that. Well done, you. Yeah. So, that's it. I can't run away from this fight. I have to keep going. And then I have these women. Joe is one of them that I have in my corner. And speaking to Joe every month has helped me to achieve balance. You know, you can't go it alone. The mistake is, oh, I'm going to do it alone. I just realized earlier on that I cannot do it alone. Yeah. If I if I go it alone, I'm going to shut down the school. I won't be here. I won't, it won't be for the long haul. And the idea of the visions that actually pushed me to start the school will be defeated. So I know how to call for help. I call for help. I, in fact, scream for help. I tell myself, <laughs> yeah. yes, I do. I scream for yeah. help. You yeah, know, I'm I not did. a super woman. I'm not, you know, I'm just a warrior woman. I act, I tell myself I'm a warrior woman. That's someone who's yeah, yeah. fighting me. But I'm not a super woman. I'm a warrior woman in that I go to the fight every day. And there's a battle to be won. And I have to wear, win it first in my head where it yeah. matters most. Because yeah. sometimes you're there and something is painting a picture that is not. So what are you going to do now? Why don't you shut the door and go home? You are defeated already. No, I don't even know how I keep the doors. Even the teachers are amazed. They come to me and say, Madam, how do you do this? And I say, I don't know. I just keep the faith. I yeah. just have to be positive. I just have to push the envelopes. But I tell them all the time, I have a tribe of women that I, I, I rely on their strength sometimes. I have to get to them and say to them, you see, I'm having a bad day. Yeah. The acceptance yeah. that I have, I'm having a bad day, is half solving the problem. But sometimes mm -hmm. people just feel, oh, I can do it all alone. I can, no, I can't do it all alone. And that's part yeah. of what gets me to be restless. And then when I see that, when I close the doors, where will these children go to? Yeah, exactly. Well, you are parents. showing them, you're giving them a very good example anyway, a mentor uh, and someone to look up to, be it as a person, but also as a female as well. It's like their mentoring is extremely crucial for children, isn't it? Isn't it? So, yeah. imitate, you know, copying your methodology and the way that you are through all this, that the children will remember. You know, it's got to be a a, a good mechanism for them to see you you know they won't see everything because obviously some of the things have to go behind closed doors and like you say you can rely on your tribe and you can talk to your ladies and, and your team you know your, your bigger family etc but at the end of the day yes i would say besides the normal everyday lessons that you're teaching them by being an educator you're also teaching them yourself personally and how to achieve and, and go for your dreams and be the mentor that you want them to be eventually for other people. Absolutely. You know? So from the point of view of the the year, you know, the rest of the year, I know it sounds a, a quite a strange question from my point of view, and then I'll let Joe ask you <laughs> something. But because we're in November now, how, how can you get to the end of the year? Do you have the two weeks uh, where the school can uh, shut for a few weeks? you know, without it being affected with COVID, etc. But are you looking forward to having a little bit of a, a breathing space for you over, over between now and the end of December? Do you get that chance? Yes, we are going to shut down on the 18th of the of December. So we go off for the New Year and the Christmas and then we resume in January so that we can recoup and recover ourselves yeah. and come back to serve the children better. So we have that, you know, we always have that. Where we, I'm even looking forward to it, but we have a lot of programs right now we are running. We are trying to get into the exam season. Once we get into December, first week, second week, that's our exam period. So once we are done with the test and all of that, we go off, we shut down the school 18th of uh, December. We normally hold a party for the children, so they have fun. The, uh, yeah. the parents have fun, so we just <laughs> shut down. They go home with good memories, so that they can come back to school uh, rejuvenated and happy to be back. So it has worked for us for these four years. It's not easy, but we we start with singing hymns and all of that, and um, you know, um, food 
we, we eat and then, you know. Yeah, <laughs> everyone's happy then, aren't they? Music, yeah. food, yeah. lovely smiles, we like that. And your well earned rest by then, I would say. I would definitely say from already speaking to you very briefly, I'd say that is very well earned on your behalf. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. What a, what a year it's been.